What's up guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Y2 walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we got our very first Pokemon and a long story to boot. I am very, very sorry guys if I talked a little too long and less action. But yes, in our last episode, we got ourselves our very first Pokemon, Sigh of the Torrent. Now the reason why I picked Sigh of the Torrent again is because, well, the team that I have planned, you might recognize it later on. It will work, and it is a pretty gar like I, I like out of the three starters for for Unova, Oshawa is my favorite because well it does come out to be a pretty badass Pokemon. As you can see, it does have Torrent the ability. Um, its nature is careful, so its special defense is not really going to be or its special attack is not going to really be there. But it's more more of a physical attacker right here. So let us complete or let us continue on right here. So, after getting your first Pokemon, he was going to be like, Hey, how long are you planning on keeping me waiting anyway? Hey, what what's that? So that's your partner, huh? That's great. My sister already said so. But take, uh, take really, really good care of your Pokemon. Got it? What's that you're holding there? Oh, and Bianca's like, It's a Pokedex! Dot, dot, dot. Turns around, and... Please give me a Pokedex too. I want to get stronger. If I have a Pokedex, I can learn about Pokemon. That'll make me stronger, right? Question mark right there. And um, uh, who are you again? I'm Hugh. I'm going to travel the Unova region with my Pokemon partner in the in order to search for everything uh, or to search for something very important. Hmm. Well, okay. I don't really get it, but going on a journey is always good. Anyway, I just happen to have another Pokedex on me. It looks like the Pokemon distribution has really changed compared to two years ago, so the more the merrier. And just like that, he gets his very first Pokedex. And, uh, well, I'm gonna be walking away from this situation, but after that, Hugh's gonna be like, let's see how good you are. I'll use my Snivy that I erased from an egg. Huh, ironically enough, he has the Pokemon typing that, yeah, he is stronger to me. So, here we go, guys, our very first trainer battle, and it's against Hugh, and he is coming out with a pretty good Snivy right here. Look at that, Snivy, looking pretty badass. The Pokemon that I originally wanted to get, but I, I, I didn't want to because, well, many of you guys already know. Many of you guys already know, I have, uh, you know, I've... I, I've this is like the third take of this whole game right here, and, you know, I, I kind of just want to like, you know, I kind of want to continue on with Sigh of the Torrent and build a very good team since, you know, you're going to be getting a lot more, you're going to get, you're going to be getting a lot more Pokemon choices right here, and yeah, you guys will be seeing some Pokemon onto this version right here, different kinds of Pokemon that, you know, you've you've seen in different versions and uh well let's see here we go tackle attack nearly beats it i might lose this one holy crud nope he gave me the <laughs> he gave me the battle right there oh my god okay so the first one is always the best one and snivy has been defeated and that gives us a lot of experience points and look at that look at that level six and we nearly grow to level seven he's like i couldn't achieve victory for my partner no you didn't okay Huh, I lost. This is different than battling uh, with, uh, with wild Pokemon. Well, whatever. I'm just happy to know that you're a trainer and I can count on. Cool, I'm hitting off first. Get stronger. Okay, all right. This guy right here is a... Uh, <laughs> the Pokemon on both sides did their best, but this little one is still weak. So battle it with it, uh, battle with it to get stronger. All righty. Let's go make your Pokemon better at the Pokemon Center. It's like the best place ever for Pokemon who battle and get hurt. Okay, whatever you say. Whatever you say. So here we are traveling to the Pokemon Center. The Pokemon Center is the same no matter where you are. Let's go inside. Hmm. Okay, let's go inside. And, well, here we are. Okay, I'll show you around in the Pokemon Center. The Pokemon Center heals Pokemon for free. You should bring your Pokemon here anytime they are weak. I'll heal your Pokemon. Hand me your Pokeball for a sec. And well, just like that, we are healing our Pokemon real quickly. Okay. Next, I'll explain the PC. This square thingy is a PC. Any trainer is free to use it. 
you can deposit Pokemon on it. Also, you can withdraw Pokemon from it. The next thing is over here. Now, here's in addition to Generation 5, I think, yes, is the Pokemon. They added the both Pokemon and Pokemon Center both together. And you out here, you can buy different, if buy and sell different items. Pokeballs you can use to catch Pokemon also can be bought at the Pokemart. Here, Draven, I'll give you some Pokeballs. And just like that, we get ourselves some Pokeballs. Yes. Next up, I'll show you how to use these Pokeballs. Follow me. Hmm. So we're going to get a tutorial from uh, from Bianca. Okay. So let's... Uh, okay, first is first. I kind of need to buy something right here. Let's go ahead and buy a few potions because... Yeah, we nearly lost. And... Yeah. So, let us move on right here. And Bianca's waiting for us outside. And she's like... Oh, wait. Hold on. Oh, nice to meet you. You must be Bianca, right? And Draven picked... Uh, and Draven picked Oshawott then? <laughs> Good looking. And... Oh, I almost forgot. Here, take these running shoes. And there it is, guys. We got ourselves some running shoes. Pretty good. A perfect fit. I'll read the instructions to you. Hold it, hold the B button to run faster than normal. Put on the running shoes and race around your heart's content. Now you and Oshawa can run anywhere you want. And Hugh's sister's going to be like, um, this is from me. We got ourselves some town maps, which is great. And... Well, Bianca's looking confused. She's like, why are there two town maps? Oh, I want you to give one to my big brother. That's that's a good idea. Even if it's a single road to the ocean, having a town map is always nice. I mean, if you use a town map, you'll know where about the Unova region is, uh, what the Unova region is like. Oh, you guys, just watching this makes me happy. Come on, we're headed to Route 19. I'll teach you how to catch Pokemon. Okay, we're going to be catching some Pokemon right here. And, well, my mom is uh, going to be saying, Bon voyage, take Oshawa, and go see many different Pokemon and people with your own eyes. Whatever you say, mama. Now, here's a little something different in Pokemon White 2. So, we are in the Unova region, but they have added a little something right here that I think you guys should see. So, as you can see, onto the map side right here. Uh, Unova has expanded just a tad bit. A little more green dots for extra stuff and this whole section right here which is different towns different cities and all that stuff uh, we got the town of Aspercha City which you know as many of you guys already know there's a gym located right here and then you got Flossessi town small town and then from there you got Verbank now there's three towns in the well the eastern side of Unova back then it was just this whole section right here with the exclusion of some of these things right here and uh, you know for me it's like I can't wait to go to New Vema town and see what actually happens over there now um, I heard that the original trainer is nowhere to be found which is kind of a bummer guys sorry for spoiling it but that that is how it is right there so let's go right ahead and you know get taught how to catch her some Pokemon now that we can actually run and look at that we are running we are running for the hills and uh, well this person is like hey Draven you can't go without oh you're Oshawa or you're with Oshawa okay this is a going away gift don't be shy take it and we get ourselves another potion which is also great when a Pokemon gets hurt take it easy and go to the Pokemon Center that is true. That is so darn true. Okay, so here is Bianca. And he's like, hey, this way. This this kind of reminds me of the day on Route 1. Okay, here's how it works. The Pokedex, uh, the Pokedex pages fill up automatically when you meet a Pokemon. And when you catch a Pokemon, more detailed information on it is added to the Pokedex. Here, I'll show you how to catch a Pokemon starting now. And, well, we're going to be learning how to capture a Pokemon right now. So, as you can see, there it's a Purloin. And Bianca coming out with a Lil Pup. And it's at level 5, which, you know, could, could prove useful right here. Now, Bianca's going to be, you know, tackling and all that crud. And, bam, it's leveling it down. Now, I think Bianca is the only person that teaches us how to capture Pokemon that actually levels down or... Yeah, that actually brings the HP down on a wild Pokemon, which is hilarious. So, yeah, this is actually pretty good right here. 
Okay, so she throws the Pokeball, and just like that, the Poke or Pokemon has been captured. Okay, so she's gonna add that to the collection right there. And Bianca's like, what a relief! I caught a Pokemon! Oh, um, right. I'll go over the important stuff, too. First, you, ha you go find a healthy Pokemon to catch. You need to remember this uh, next bit. It's it's best to lower the Pokemon's HP before you try and catch it. Use your Pokemon's move to lower the HP of the Pokemon you want to catch. Making it fall asleep or paralyzing it will make it e even easier to catch. You're going to deliver the town map to your friend, right? Continue straight to uh, continue uh, straight this way to get to Flossessi Town. Bye now. Meet lots of different Pokemon and catch a lot of them. Okay. Alrighty. Okay, so we're gonna stop right here, guys. I know, I know, short episodes, we don't like it. It is what it is, guys, okay? In the next episode, we're gonna be going straight to Flossessi Town. We're gonna be doing some things, and hey, we might even capture an old team member of ours. So stay tuned, guys. I will be back for another episode of Pokemon White 2. See you guys.